And here we have Nigeria against Poland. I'm Peter Drury, and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beckley. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. the lineups for the game. go then Jim you've played in games of this nature who can make the difference I would go for Robert Lewandowski as good a center forward with his back to goal as I've seen he can turn and roll defenders for fun and once facing his target he has all the finishing skills that you could require yeah hard to see past him he'll be looking to put on a show I'm certain of that has got rid of that goes long and forward tries a through ball and he's made certain that won't get through gets it upfield Moses Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Moses. And back out it comes. Yeah, he's offering an apology for that. He needed to deliver a better ball. Igalo gets it back. Onazi tries running with the ball at his feet. Hits one! And he's done it! And Nigeria are ahead! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Nigeria break the deadlock. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Plays a clever pass. Hits it! They've done it! They have come roaring back! I think he just thought about trying his look from further out there, but why bother when you can worm your way through a defence like that? It's it's terrific play to, to get through and score. Poland grab the equaliser and we're all square. 
Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Referee's given a throw. Moses pumps it upfield. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Look, all it needs now is a slightly later run beyond that defence and the flag will stay down. It's a move that looks very promising and, of course, the timing is absolutely key. Here, Nacho tings it in. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Blaszczykowski. Right now, what's on? Here, Nacho has a look inside the box. Chance! In with a header! Really well taken goal! And they get themselves in front! <laughs> oh, the cross was inch perfect and the header unerring. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Nigeria go into the lead. Here, Nacho. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Gonna make this theirs. Nicolo. And it's half time here. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Very little in it. The score at half time is two goals to one. Nicolo. Onazi tries to switch the play. Blaszczykowski. Decent progress down the left. And here's the chance to counter. Clears it out of harm's way. Moses delivers. Meets it first time! Free kick's been given. For Koviak. Onazi takes control of it and he's on the move. Spoon forward. And it's Igalo. A real chance to break. Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. That wasn't the easiest of saves by any means, Peter, and I think his instincts were, well, they were just razor sharp. 
Oh, he really wanted that. He's been a joy to watch, and, and that didn't miss by much. He'll be back. Point blank header! And he's kept it out. it upfield. In the end, they found themselves penned in, nowhere to go. Oh, good interception. Can he find a finish now? Gets good distance on it. Kukoviak with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Yeah, uh, he may feign to shoot and just play it into the box. Away from immediate danger. And that's out of reach. Well, you have to feel a little for the player who been taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Krasicki, 75 minutes played. A chance! Has a swing at it! It's in! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Nigeria take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Tries to dink it in. Lewandowski, Mikel sticks in a foot to win it back. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Up to meet it! Surely now, beyond all doubt. A lovely header, but really, it was all about the delivery. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Nigeria blast themselves into a three-goal lead. Lukas Piszczek gets it back. And the defence can get it clear. Kukoviak. Lukas Piszczek. Kukoviak. Now it's Lewandowski. He's gone for it! Saved! That's good keeping. Well played, he saw that coming. Thrust towards the front line. Looks like a good ball through. Now, can he capitalise? Goes for goal! And with the goal at his mercy, a dreadful miss. Krasitsky. Nikola. And in time is up, and there goes the whistle. Nigeria, winners of a no contest. They just swamped their opponents in superior quality. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, this was a, a pretty...